Hello anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII. Uh, in the last episode, we uh, blew up... No, we didn't blow anything up. Shinra blew up the plate support beam thingy-majiggy, and uh, now we're here down in a place, and I just realized... I think I forgot something. Holy shit. Let's run back real quick. Because I realized during a cutscene... Ah, oh, great. Random battles. Awesome. My favorite thing ever in the world. During a cutscene, I think I saw a materia on the ground. And then they popped us out into a different area at the end of the cutscene. <laughs> so I just realized... That, uh... Did it just, like, fart all over Tifa? I think it did. God damn it. No, oh, don't, 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 don't waste your limit break just yet there, girly. Yeah, no, I probably should have gone back and got it at the end of the last episode, but I completely forgot. Also, let's, uh, use some items here. Oh, they didn't give us, uh, they didn't give us the materia back, did they? Up steel command, yep. And, uh, ice. Yep, he's got nothing. Okay, yeah, no, great. We're down to just potions for now until we can get Eris back. Uh, sure. But yeah, so I probably should have gotten it at the end of the last episode, but I completely forgot it because I got so caught up in the excellent cutscene. No, don't shoot rockets at them. Jeez. Alright. Hey, that's actually pretty good damage there, Tifa. Good job. And the stupid house thing isn't doing a lot of damage. That's even better. Excellent. I love it when enemies don't do a lot of damage. That's just the best thing ever. Absolutely. Alright. Hurry up. I don't want to have to edit these freaking fights out. Don't take too long, please. Thank you. Just want to get to the other end of the thing. Climb up there, thank you. And up here. Damn it! <laughs> oh, God. Why me? Alright, Barrett. Start smacking the ones in the back. Keith and Cloud will knock out the ones in the front, I guess. Just like that. Good. Awesome. Awesome. One dead already. There you go. No, Cloud, you... Fine, whatever. Use it on the one in the back, I guess. Just because. Better be a one-hit kill. Yeah, damn right. Cloud, why do you have such low health all of a sudden? Why did they all attack you so much? Did they get a crit on you and I didn't notice? These are all possibilities. Now we have to waste more potions! Yay! Woohoo! Awesome. So, yeah, right there, that little yellow blob. Received sense materia. What does this do? Let's put it on Barrett, maybe, since he doesn't have a thing. Oh, they did give us the restore back. Alright, what's sense do? Equips sense command. Sure, you can have that, buddy. Store lightning all. Okay, and sure, you can have lightning too. And let's equip old Cloudy Wowdy here. Who has the most MP? Cloud, okay. He has 108. What? No, not equip, sorry, materia. Why did it push me onto the equip screen? It's so stupid. Cover, let's replace this with restore, put that in all, and put steel down here. Sure. Awesome. Great. Fantastic. Got sense command, and apparently they did give us the materia back that Eris had. How kind of them. And now that I've wasted the first 4 minutes and 38 seconds of this video backtracking to a place we've already been to, now we can hopefully go back over all these stupid whole oh, things. And, uh... Yeah. Yeah, exactly what I'm saying. Just gibberish. Utter fucking gibberish. 
after we kill a few of these, I'll have Cloud use his healing magic. Why would you punch the one in the back? Whatever, Tifa. Nothing you do makes sense. Oh god, they're all gonna die, aren't they? Yup. Damn it. God damn it. Oh well, that's fine. That's fine. It doesn't matter. We'll get into another random battle soon enough, I'm sure. And then we'll really be screwed. Just like this. Yay. Awesome. Who are these things? Great. Okay. Bit you! Magic cure! Everybody! Tifa! Punch that one! Right in its mouth! Don't get your hands cut, though! Awesome! Everybody's really super healed! You're so good at that, Cloud! Almost as good as Eris! Too bad she's dead now! Haha! <laughs> I'm joking! They would never kill off a main character as important as her! Uh, alright, alright, yeah, skip, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now we're over here, now we can save the game, you know what, real episode starts here! Just ignore that first, uh, 6 minutes and 34 seconds, that didn't count. Save files locally saved, yes sirree it has. Hello, anyone and everyone, I'm Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII. Ha! See? I can do it. Just ignore the first 6 minutes and 58 seconds of the video. Pretend it started here. We're killing things. Not so innocent creatures that live in the slum. Why do all these wild animals live in the slum? Why? It's a slum. It's where people live. Clearly, those people aren't just constantly getting killed. Oh, hey! Cool. I don't think this is where we're supposed to go. But that's cool. So, have I gone the wrong way? I think I have. Alright. Amazing. Well, what's in the... Actually, didn't we go through, like, the rafters of her house? Hey, it's kids! And we saw the flash of Eris. Um, we are, um, taking care of the, um, flowers for the, um, lady here. Is that okay? Oh, I don't care. Take good care of them. Yeah, sure. Um, but yeah, as you guys may have noticed there, there was actually a little flash right in the middle, uh, between the two kids of Eris. And I believe that's actually a, a well-known glitch in this game, that every time you enter this room, uh, or maybe not every time. Let's see, is it every time? Yep, every time you enter this room, you see a little flash of Eris standing there. Right there. <laughs> over and over and over again. And, uh... The fact that it, uh, oh, there are a lot of people who think that uh, the fact that you see this is supposed to be something very spoilery for the end of the game, um, but the fact that it happens at this point in the game, as well as at the end, uh, means it's just a, a weird visual glitch, but it's really cool. And if you didn't know about it, and if you came back here at the end of the game, and you saw that, you'd probably be like, Whoa, holy crap, it's her, because of the thing that happens that, um, for some reason feel obligated to sp not spoil, even though it's literally the most spoiled thing on the internet in the history of video games ever. Everybody knows what happens in this game. But, okay, so we can't, for some reason... Do I have to interact with it? Nope. Okay, we just can't go back there for some reason. Alright, so we're not getting out that way. Ugh. Alright, to the right is... The exit. So I guess we have to go up? Not, not there. Nope. Not you. Stop! 
random battles. What are you doing to me? You're killing me here. But Jesus. Alright. Actually, I probably should have had her punch the red thing in the front. Because I believe the red things have very little health. And she probably could have killed it in one hit. Like there. Oops. Silly me. Alright, whatever. Let's keep going. Back this way. I guess we'll go up now. Maybe that's how we get to Eris' house. I don't remember. Um, hey, is the sick guy still sick? Oh, ugh, ugh. I guess so. Damn. Even with all that commotion, you went on like nothing happened. You must have really been through the mill to get to like to get like that. Cannot speak. My nose is stuffed up. Sniff, sniff. First there was a rumbling, then cracking, and then her kablam. Er, then kablam. I was so scared. Sniff. Great. Finally think you're making a living in the pits of Mingar, and then a big piece of scrap like that falls down here. What's next? Yeah, that's right, but even so, where could we move to now? So, did they not know it was intentionally blown up? I guess so. I guess everybody's completely fucking oblivious. How do we get out of here? How do we get to Harris's house? Oh my god. I already tried the, like, upper left section up here. This isn't actually, like, a, an exit. Just a dead end. We've been through this before. Okay. Well, great. I don't know where the hell I'm going. I might actually have to edit the stupid video to get to where we're supposed to go. Um, let's try over here. Let's try all the way over here. No, that's right, because we ended up jumping down here. There was a scene after Eris and Cloud escaped from Reno and the rest of the Turks. There was a scene of them jumping across like the ramshackle roofs, and we landed down here. And then we went left to get to Eris's house. Didn't we? Oh jeez, I don't know. Why are those things getting to attack so much? Whatever. Cloud finished it off. Good job. Alright. Let's just check to the right, because I do have one little idea. Maybe if what we're supposed to do is come out here, and can we go off to the right? Does that do anything? Can we get into random battles here? I hope not. Oh boy, I hope not. Okay, nope, dead end over there. Left is probably also a dead end. And of course, we never came this way earlier, so this probably isn't the way to Eris' house, even if there wasn't a dead end over here. But I have to check. Nope, dead end. Okay, great. Awesome. Fantastic. Back this way, then. So, now what? Because I thought to the left led to... led to Sector 6 with the Don Cornello dude. I thought that's where Wall Market was, off to the left, through here. This is the only way- th and this is where we came from! The stupid cutscene! Back here again! The stupid cutscene dropped us off in here, when we were coming from the other direction! So what the fuck? What the fuck, game? Am I just dumb? Am I just really dumb and missing something here? I don't know. I honestly don't. Are you kidding me? How'd that not die? That was good damage. That was... Uh, whatever. Tifa finished that one off, I guess. Thank you. Alright. And that one just dies in one shot? What the hell? Oh, I don't know. Oh well. Alright, let's try going up here again. And... Oh. 
Yeah, because we were in the, the playground place. And... Like, we're actually... We're in Sector 6 right now. And Eris lives in Sector 6. But I thought Eris was off in the opposite direction. Because we saw... Earlier, when we saw Tifa being taken on the, like, heart or whatever... Um, by Don Cornelio, he came out of the big door. Let's use some cure. Oh, don't use your thing yet. Everybody get healed up. I think this thing's almost dead. Yeah, exactly. Um, oh, I'll explain it better when we can friggin' see the thing. Okay, up here, please don't interrupt me with the right into battle, thank you. When we were up here before, we were in the playground, and we were sitting up on top of this thing with the slide, and that's when we saw the cutscene where the Don came out of the, the big door right here, and he had Tifa on the back, and that's when Eris first saw Tifa, and they went off to the right, and to the right was Wall Market. That's why we went to Wall Market, because we saw the Don taking Tifa. So this can't lead to freaking Eris' house. Unless there's a branch up here that I don't remember. No, it's just Wall Market. It's literally all just Wall Market. Where the fuck is Eris' house? That is where we're supposed to go, isn't it? Oh my god. So many problems arising in this playthrough. All in this one episode. Just come here to episode 11 or whatever the frick, and for all your Final Fantasy 7 problems, every single one. And this is to the. This is up to the Don's Mansion. We don't want to go there. Marlene's not going to be at the Don's Mansion. How the hell do I even know Marlene's at. Eris' house. I just think I remember that from my first playthrough. I could be wrong. Honestly. I could be dead wrong. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Well. Yeah, this doesn't make any sense. Because I remember... I remember when we were with Eris the first time... We came through here, and it was because Eris had to show us the way, so she led us up through this, like, she led us up through this place, um, to, to show us the way to, to Wall Market or whatever, because Cloud was going to go there for some other reason. Or no, she was showing him the way back to... Back to Sector 7. And that's why she took him to the Sector 7 door. And that's when we saw the Don coming out of it. Um... Yeah. But she had to lead us up through here, so her house must be on the other end. But then where the hell is it? Oh my god, down here... No, not down here! I'm getting so lost. This place has a stupid layout, and now I'm getting mad because this place is stupid. I literally cannot remember how to get to our house, and that might not even be the thing we're supposed to be doing. Did she maybe leave Marlene in the town with the people? Like the shitty part of town that we're near right now? She might have. God damn it. Oh my god. Blade beam gained. Blade beam, people! Up here. Up here. Where did she leave Marlene? Is Marlene in the in here? With the old dude? And the drunkard? Nope. I don't see a Marlene here. Is Marlene in here? Is Marlene with you? We only try items for Gil here, no matter what. Yeah, oh, 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 I could probably use some of these, uh, 
Let's buy... Sure, let's buy 21. I don't even care. Let's get out of here. Is Marlene with you? Never thought that would come tumbling down. Maybe I better walk around looking up from now on. Yeah, because that'll help you if the entire ceiling starts coming down, the miles wide plate above you. If that starts coming down, oh yeah, you can just you can just walk away as long as you see it in time. It's not here. Oh my god. Up here! Holy crap! Oh my god. I might cut some of that out. I don't know. That took me way too long. 20 minutes and 47 seconds to get here. Elmira. Cloud, was it? It's about Eris, isn't it? Sorry, the Shinra have her. I know. They took her from here. They were here. That was what Eris wanted. Why is Shinra after Eris? Eris is an ancient, the sole survivor. What'd you say? But aren't you her mother? Not her real mother. It must have been 15 years ago. During the war, my husband was sent to the front, some faraway place called Wu Tai. Yo, Wu Tai! One day I went to the station because I got a letter saying he was coming home on leave. Yep. Yep, that's the station. Could you walk a little faster, maybe? Oh no, did the husband not show up? Aww. He ain't coming, is he? But she got the le letter saying he was coming home. My husband never came back. I wonder if something happened to him. Really, you think? No, I'm sure his leave was just cancelled. I went to the station every day. Then, one day... The hell? Oh, is that Eris's actual mother? She's lying dead on the on the pavement there? And the guards just standing there staring? You used to see this sort of thing a lot during the war. Her last words were, please take Eris somewhere safe. My husband never came back. I had no child. I was lonely, so I decided to take her home with me. Eris and I became close very quickly. That child loved to talk. She used to talk to me about everything. She told me how she escaped from some kind of research laboratory and that her mother had already returned to the planet, so she wasn't lonely. Many other things. Return to the planet? Oh no! I didn't know what she meant. I asked if she meant a star in the sky, but she said it she said it was this planet. She was a mysterious child in many ways. Mom. Please don't cry. Eris just blurred that out all of a sudden when I asked her if something happened. Someone dear to you has just died. His spirit was coming to see you, but he's already returned to the planet. At that time, I didn't believe her. But, several days later, we received a notice saying my husband died. And that was it. A lot had happened, but we were happy. Until one day, this blonde, pointy-haired jerk-off came into our house and just announced, I'm living here now, my name's Cloud, and I'm taking your daughter for mine. No, that didn't happen. Whoops. Oh, sorry. No, it was saying. Oh, I... 
Oh, I mixed up the words, the subtitles, all translation issues. We want you to return Eris to us. We've been searching for her for a long time. No, never! Eris, you're a very special child. You are of a special blood. Your real mother was an ancient. At that moment, I found out she was an ancient. The ancients will lead us to a land of supreme happiness. Eris will be able to bring happiness to all those in the slums. That is why Shinra would like Eris' cooperation. He's wrong! I'm not an ancient, I'm not! Oh, the yawning never stops! But Eris, surely you hear voices sometimes when you're all alone? No, I don't! But I knew. I knew about her mysterious powers. She tried so hard to hide it, so I acted as though I never noticed. Oh, different camera angle. It's amazing how she's uh, avoided the Shinra for all these years. Yeah, if they knew about her when she was a child, why didn't they just capture her back then? They clearly don't mind forcibly taking people from their homes. So what would it have, like, what did it accomplish waiting all these years? The Shinra need her, so I guess they wouldn't harm her. But why now? She brought a little girl here with her. Sang found them on their way here. She probably wasn't fast enough to get away. She decided to go to the Shinra in exchange for the little girl's safety. Marlene! Marlene! Eris was caught because of Marlene! I'm sorry. Marlene's my daughter. I'm really sorry. I can't do a fucking voice. I swear to God. You're her father? How in the world could you ever leave a child alone like that? Please don't start with that. I'm always thinking about what might happen to Marlene if I... But you gotta understand something. I don't got any answers. I want to be with Marlene, but I gotta fight. Oh, Jesus, I just can't. Oh, it's a mess. Because if I don't, the planet's gonna die. So I'm gonna keep fighting. But inside, I'm always thinking of her. I just want to be with her. Always. See? I'm going in circles now. I think I know what you mean. She's upstairs asleep. Why don't you go and see her? Sigh. She just said sigh out loud. Great. It's my fault. I was the one who got Eris involved in this. Yeah, probably. Don't say that. Eris doesn't think so. How do you know what Eris thinks? She's gone. She's been kidnapped. She didn't come home and just pop in, say, hi, mom, by the way, here's my opinion of Tifa, I don't blame her for anything. No, that didn't happen. I think people could blame Tifa for more things, in fact. I'm so glad. I'm so glad you're alright. Daddy, don't cry. Your whiskers hurt. Have you not told her the English word for beard yet, Barrett? Cloud! You gonna go help Eris, right? She done so much for me. If the Shinra are involved, I ain't staying here. I'm coming too. Guess what? Guess what? Eris asked me lots of questions. Like what kind of person Cloud is. I bet she likes you, Cloud. <sighs> Fuck if I know. Dummy. Yup. Sure. Now let's go back downstairs. Sigh again. Hmm. It's my fault. Blah blah blah. No, no. Okay. So I. T okay. I guess I have to talk to them more to continue the scene. Dummy. Nope. Oh, okay. We're just leaving then. All right, everyone. We're on our way out. You're going after Eris, right? Yeah. I'm coming with you. We're going right into Shinra headquarters. You gotta be prepared for the worst. I know. Right now, I feel I have to push myself to the limit. If I stayed here, I'd go crazy. Oh, pff, I thought that was the sound of someone knocking on the door. It was just him running down the stairs. Sorry, but can you take care of Marlene a bit longer? Yes, I don't mind. I apparently love adopting other people's children and treating them as my own. 
This place is dangerous now. You better go somewhere else. Why is it... Why, why is it dangerous? They already got Eris. They have no reason to come back here. You're right. But promise me that you'll come back to her. Don't get yourself killed. Sure. Don't say a word. Just everybody look at each other and nod and then walk out. Because this is like an anime. How do we get to the Shinra building? There ain't no train that goes up there anymore. Hmm. Well, let's go to Wall Market. We might be able to find something there. Sure. Sure. We'll do that, and we'll do it in the next episode, because I'm out of time for now. Oh, oops, sorry. Don't know how much I'm going to have to cut out of wandering around trying to find Eris' stupid house. But, uh, regardless, I think we're good. So, yeah, I hope you've all enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye <laughs>